Hey guys, it's Millie. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm just going to be showing you guys some of my favorite thrifted finds and then styling them into like proper outfits and doing a little try on for you guys. Also, if you want to see more clothes and my outfits, go follow my Instagram, a daily dose of Millie. Linked in the description box along with like our TikTok and Chloe's Instagram and stuff. So go follow those. I usually post outfit of the days on my story plus where I got everything from. So yeah, check that out. Anyways, let's try on some thrifted looks. The first thing is this skirt. Um, it is Argyle pattern. Absolutely obsessed with Argyle at the moment. Um, it's just like stretchy. It's got this like elastic band. It's very long though, like look at this. I don't even know if I can show you. Do you see how long that is? So I kind of, when I wear it, I have to like pull it up a lot. So it's like a mini skirt because I do like my mini skirts. I like to show off my unshaved legs. Ew, I don't know why I said that, that was so weird. So yeah, um, the day that I found this, I was like looking for Argyle. I think I manifested it honestly, had never found anything Argyle in my life. Went out of that, thrift store with three different pieces this is one of them i love this skirt it's so cute i think it's cute for summer i also just have this little top on from brandy melville and a little pearl necklace so yeah next is this jumper oh my god i genuinely think it's one of my favorite things i've ever thrifted ever which i mean it's the whole purpose of this video but like this one is like it so this is the argyle jumper that i found at the thrift store I literally went in there with that like Brandy Melville blue argyle cardigan in mind and then I pulled this. You're telling me the universe doesn't deliver manifestations? God, why am I speaking like this? I genuinely like, I'm so energetic right now. Like something is like pulsing through my veins. I think there's coffee pulsing through my veins from a few days ago, even though it was decaf. Because I don't drink caffeine coffee, it's like too strong. Maybe like tasting exact same. Why am I talking about coffee? I don't know. Of course I've put a collar under it because like collars under like crew necks or like jumpers look so good. If you don't know what to wear, get a crew neck, get a collared top and you're set to go. Um, I also have a pair with these jeans which I will show you. Definitely my favourite pair of jeans that I've ever thrifted. I did not actually thrift this. My cousin Chloe, who I also have this channel with, if you're new, um, she found these. And then she was like, do you want them? They don't fit me. I was like, yes. Um, they're literally amazing. Let me show you. So I just took off my jumper so you could see these jeans better. But they're literally amazing. They're like just under, um, like like high waisted. They're so long, like they literally fall down to my ankle, which I absolutely love the look of jeans that like go over your shoe. And then the like pockets, I don't know if you can see this. It has this sort of like carpentry vibe. Um, big pockets and at the back there's little like flat pockets. They kind of stick up all the time though, which is kind of annoying. But I'm obsessed with these jeans. I literally wear them almost every day, my fave pair. Tell me this isn't cute as. The next thing is this other Argyle jumper. It's a lot more simple, it just has the one stripe. Dark grey with like the red and grey plain on the back. Um, but, oh my god, if you want to see me happy, you should have seen me when I first put on this outfit. Like, I literally love the look of collar jumpers on tennis skirts. I got this one from Factory. I absolutely love this. And this jumper is quite baggy, which I like. It's not like tight fitting around the arms or anything, which is perfect. It's a little bit itchy, but I still love like this jumper so much, especially with this outfit. Okay, this next top I'm honestly obsessed with. I kind of want to wear it every day. I found it in the lingerie section and I was like, oh my god, and it fits really like nice and like tight. It's like just so pretty and like kind of dainty vibes. Um, looks like that. I love the like the flowers and all the colours. And I literally have the perfect like bags for this. I can either do this one, which matches the blue perfectly, or the dark purple which matches the purple perfectly. Tip, when you go to the thrift store, make sure you always, and I mean always look in the like lingerie section. You will find the cutest little dresses and tops there. I swear I found the cutest things like this top. First of all, this really cute little Sydney top and it's like all embroidered. I think it's so cute and the color's really nice. But then on the same day, I went into the bags and I literally found the bag that matched this perfectly. Like you're telling me that God didn't send these two pieces down and was like, create this outfit. 
literally look how perfectly they match and I absolutely love looking for baguette bags. I'm pretty sure that's what they're called. Little shoulder bags. Um, anyways, I just love this outfit. I think it looks so cool together. Jeans are from Brandy Melville, by the way. But we're not talking about that. We're talking about the things I thrifted. So, yeah, I love this top. Um, if you want to look for baby tees, definitely head over to the kids section. Especially the little boys section. Like, I feel like that is like where you should be at. I'm going to show you some of the other baby tees that I've bought. So, let's go through them quickly. This one is a little, little bit uncomfortable because like under the arms, it's literally like digging into me, but I had to get it. Like, tell me that's not the, one of the cutest Adidas tops you've ever seen. And it's got the little stripes down the side. Once again, grab my purple bag, hit the town. This is the next baby tee. It's just this cute little like blue color. It's got this really cute little like telephone on it and the sleeves are striped. I really like tops that have a different like sleeve colour or pattern to like the like the main like graphic area. I don't know the anatomy of t-shirts very well. But yeah, this one's really cute too. I'm bringing in some longer tops. I honestly completely forgot I got this one. I absolutely love it now that I've refound it. It's this beautiful mint green colour and it says big day out. And it has these like cute little like I think these are called frangipanis. Um absolutely love the look of frangipanis on tops like Gives me such like Hawaii vibes. Um, this Hawaii top is so cool. It's a little bit baggier than the rest of them. I think it was in like the normal section. But it just says Hawaii with a really cool surfboard. I absolutely love the way it looks. It is... Is that rip curl? Yeah, no, that is not rip curl. Oh my god, I lied. And the actual like main t-shirt has this like... I don't know, like Hawaiian kind of print on it. I just realized it's kind of coming off. But it's okay. I really like it. The last baby tee I'm going to show you is another like Hawaii one. It's so cute. I absolutely love this pink color. Works perfectly with my little pink bag that I also thrifted. Um, it just says Aloha with the... I'm pretty sure the Hawaiian number plate does have a rainbow on it. So I think it's meant to look like a number plate. Yeah. It's really cute though. It's got the little like light pink hearts. I absolutely love it. I think the colors are super cute and it matches my bags. This is definitely one of the cooler oversized t-shirts that I found. It is this really like colorful ACDC one. It is real ACDC. It's got the tag on it. No, I don't listen to them. Don't attack me. I just honestly buy things that it, which I think are cute. It's brown and I just love all the colors in it. I genuinely think it's so cool and I've just paired it with this skirt. Obviously it would probably look better with jeans but I'm just trying to like give you guys some inspiration. I absolutely love the look of like skirts poking out of tops. This would actually match my new shoes very well. Yeah, I'm just trying to flex my shoes, not gonna lie. But like look, it actually does match. Next top is this kiss top. Once again, I love the graphic of it. No, I don't listen to them. Sorry, not sorry. Um, definitely look in the men's t-shirts if you want like good oversized um, tops. There's usually a lot of them, so you have to look through a lot. But you can usually find some cute stuff. Um, this is it. I've got paired it with these like baggy jeans. Once again, from Brandy Melville. This is definitely one of the best tops that I've got. It is just so big and so colourful and fun. It's this like rainbow tie-dye vibe from Windsor Mountain Summer Camp. I did search them up, and they're actually a real summer camp. So obviously, someone went and then donated their top which I don't know why you do like hello souvenirs but yeah it's super cute so this is another graphic top that I got it's a little bit full on I still think it's really cool it just says like Stuart Joe Gibbs racing I think that's like some car racing or something once again got my light blue jeans little black headband which is super cute and some layered necklaces just to like I don't know girly it up a little bit so next is this cool little like scarf that I got. I got this one a while ago actually. I did get it before scarf tops were that trendy. Like I'm not trying to flex on you guys or anything. Yeah, I'm a trendsetter, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, you know, I'm joking. I did accidentally wrap it with the side with the tag on it. But it's a massive scarf and it just ties up at the back. Um, you can find scarves at a lot of thrift stores. I did find this one as well. But it's a little bit small for my body. I definitely really like this scarf. It's super cool. It's got these horses. Kind of looks like the horses are on my boobs, which they are. Which is kind of annoying because the actual scarf has this really cool, like, greenery in the middle. But I can't really show it because I have to fold it over so many times. I just got my hair in this little, like, clip. I think it's super cute. Once again, got the layered necklaces going on. It's really cute. You could definitely dress it up or down with a pair of jeans or a cute little, like, skirt. Something like that. Maybe some nice, dressy black pants. 
I don't really have those. So yeah, I've just styled it like this. I kind of look like a little boy in this outfit, but the next piece is obviously this blue vest. I just have it with this white top underneath and a little butterfly necklace, which I also thrifted and is probably my favorite jewelry piece I've thrifted. Um, it's just a little butterfly. I think it's from Louisa, honestly. But this blue vest, I absolutely love. I love the look of vests on like t-shirts or turtlenecks or just plain. I've just got a little white t-shirt under this one. One of my fave pieces, which is a bit concerning since it is so boring, literally so boring, but it's okay. And then I was just wearing it with my shoes, which I know don't entirely match, but like the blues, it's a bit like monochromatic. This is the next vest. It is sort of ugly. I can definitely attest to that. Actually, it's kind of cute. I don't know how to feel about it. It's just this like beige color with this like really nice like lace and this like ribbon. I don't know what I was thinking. I think my mum probably encouraged me to buy this. Probably like threw her back to like the vintage, ugly, weird fashion days. No offense, mum. Like, yeah, so I got this vest, repaired it with some dark jeans, and then I did wear it with, I wore it with this pink puffer jacket, which I also thrifted. I actually thrifted this puffer jacket in America, and I literally have loved it ever since. So go 2018 me for buying a pink puffer jacket. You can really see my bright blue bra through this, but the next thing I got is this really pretty little slip dress. Um, it just looks like this at the top. I absolutely love the little like lace design. I think it just makes it dress really cute. It's a very like silky satiny material. I absolutely love it. Once again found in the lingerie section. <sighs> lingerie section is kind of pulling through. I do have two other ones but this is just the plain one and my favorite. I think it was like five bucks which is perfect. This top I kind of feel the need to include because I love it and like hate it at the same time. So like you guys can like let me know if it's ugly or not. It is just this little like um sequiny top that like is like halter sort of vibes. I think it's kind of cool, a bit like 2000s esque Y2K, you feel me? Got this cute little mill necklace on, matches the little sequins. Yeah, I still think it's really cool. I could like see myself going to a party in this. Obviously a very casual party, but yeah. You can't even tell me this doesn't look a little cool. Like, mm. It's quite long though. So finally, I'm just going to show you all of the bags that I've thrifted because I love all of them. So I'm not just going to include one. I'm going to include all of them. You may have seen some of them with the other outfits, but I'm just going to show you now. Um, first is this cute little Roxy number. I love it. It's just beige with the cute little pink Roxy writing. This is another Roxy bag that I found. Just got some white and brown detailing on a pink bag. And the other side just has some cute little hearts on it. Next, I have this black and white bag. It's just black with white handles. This is my go-to bag of all time. It gives me that Prada shoulder bag vibe. It's a cute little shape. Then this like brown, white and yellow one. Next is just this pink one, which is a perfect color for a lot of my clothes. And it has this soft body. And finally, this green one, which is a bit longer, but I absolutely love the color of it. This is the aftermath with some clothes on the floor as well. Oh yeah, this is gonna be so fun to clean up. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed like seeing some of my favorite thrifted pieces and how I styled them. I'm definitely gonna have fun cleaning up all these clothes. Uh, yeah. Don't forget to follow us on our Instagrams and TikTok, which will be linked down below in the description box. So definitely go check those out and I'll see you guys soon. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Peace out. Bye.